Hello, welcome back to our channel. We are making another video about some of our pets. Um, well, actually, to be honest, they're not our pets yet. And this is a secret mission, isn't it, Flynn? Uh-huh. So we are going to go down to the supermarket, but don't tell mum whatever you do, because she gets the ump when we hatch too many animals. And we're going to buy some eggs to put in our incubator to see if we can hatch any out. So what have we decided to buy? Well, we're going to get some quail eggs. So quail eggs are a really good idea because they take the least time to hatch, so it won't take us very long to work out whether uh, we've been successful or not. So how long do quail eggs take to hatch? 19 to 21 days. Perfect. So we're going to nip down to the supermarket, buy some eggs, come back, put them in our incubator, and we'll talk you through that process when we get there. We won't get the reduced ones. So, if you put that, those in the basket and I'll give you these. If you put the ones in your hand in the basket and I'll give you these. Hi there, welcome back. It's Rob. Flynn. Elora. And we are doing a bit of an experiment to see if we can buy some quail eggs from the supermarket, so ones that are for eating, put them in our incubator and see if we can get any chicks out. So earlier on, Flynn and I went down to the supermarket and we bought three dozen eggs. Got a packet each, 12 in each. Um, we're gonna put them in our Arcom Max 20 incubator that we use for hatching some of our chicken eggs and see how we get on. So, how long does a quail egg take to hatch? 19 to 21 days. Perfect. And what, how have we set the temperature on our... 37.7 temperature. Yeah, degrees centigrade. And 45... Percent humidity. Yeah. So we've got some water in here, but the incubator automatically keeps that, that humidity. It's sitting at 44 at the moment, which is fine. Uh, so that will uh, keep the eggs at the perfect temperature, perfect humidity. What else does the incubator do for us? It turns the eggs round um, yep. and turns the eggs round three hours a day. Every three hours, the, the incubator turns the eggs. And it just does that by sliding the floor. Okay, perfect. So, should we give it a go at putting these carefully into the incubator, yeah? Quail eggs have been in the incubator for a little while now. Um, how many do we think have got chicks growing in them? We think they've got two. Okay, and how do we tell if there's an embryo growing in the egg? So we get a can, a, a, a torch, um, when it's starting to get dark outside, and we turn all the lights off. Yep. And we put the torch on the eggs, and then there should usually be. Um, if it's fertile, a small heart inside. Yes, and like a little, growing chick. Yeah, a little, a little blob growing inside the egg. It's really difficult to tell inside quail eggs because they've got such a speckledy shell. Uh, they, um, it's difficult to see the embryo growing inside. Um, so it's difficult to show you on video. So we think we've got two, which isn't necessarily the best ratio, is it? Out of thirty-six eggs, two fertile. Yeah. But actually, these eggs would have been in salads on top of risottos. So we think that we've got any fertile is absolutely amazing. So we are going to monitor them going forward and we'll let you know how we get on. The eggs have now been in the incubator for 16 days now and two of the eggs are starting to hatch. If you look really closely at this video, you might even see them wriggling. So fingers crossed, we might get some chicks in the next couple of days.
Okay, so sorry slightly about the angle, and we've moved on to the GoPro, so the sound quality might not be quite as good. But we have managed to hatch two chicks from the quail eggs that we bought from the shop. And that's these two little fellas here. Um, the bigger chicks are uh, chicken chicks that hatched the day before. So this big guy in the middle here, he's not actually that big at all, he just looks big, and he's an Australorp chick. And there's a guy that's lurking behind the camera because he's a bit camera shy. And this is an old English game bantam. So we're going to do some more videos about um, how our chicks grow up, uh, both the quail and the chick, chicken chicks. So subscribe and like um, this video and you'll see uh, the videos as, as we put them on YouTube. So have we got any names for these yet? No, except for this guy. What's his name? Puffball, because he's really fluffy. He is a bit fluffier than the rest, isn't he? So if you've got suggestions about what you think we should call our quail chicks, put them in the comments below and we will pick one uh, that we like the best. 